What's up, y'all? What if you had a personal assistant that automatically schedules your entire week? It knows when you're most productive and it's going to make sure you actually get stuff done all without you having to think about it or touch it. And I know it sounds a little bit too good to be true and not actually really when with all the changes with AI and all the stuff that's going on. But that's exactly what I've been using for the past few months now. And it has completely changed my productivity game all the way around. And basically, I'm going to show you how this AI tool has helped me 10x my productivity while still maintaining that work life balance that we all looking for. And I'm Tech Back Trey, and I'm actually going to be talking about something that's been a game changer for me. It's called reclaim.ai. And before y'all think this is just another like productivity app review or something like that, mm -hmm. I'm going to tell y'all this, this is different. Okay. Like I spent some months trying to see how this is different from all the other ones. And as somebody who's juggling like a career, creating content, trying to have a life outside of that, right. Family finding time for anything. It really used to be kind of a nightmare for me. Like you know, missing the stuff, forgetting about stuff that I scheduled, forgetting about stuff my wife scheduled. You know, she has to remind me because it's in the calendar, but because I didn't, you know, save it yet, um, or maybe it's not in the calendar and I should have put it in there, all that stuff. I have went through it all, right? Uh, me wanting to do things and then forgetting that I wanted to do that because I didn't put it in the schedule. I know y'all know what I'm talking about. And here's the thing, y'all. What I'm about to show y'all and talk to y'all about is not about just managing the time better. It's about letting AI do all the heavy lifting of actually putting in the schedule so that you can focus on what really matters to you. And the craziest part, y'all, it's free to use with a Google Calendar. So let's get into it. Now, they got a bunch of different features that can change the game for you. I'm sure of that. But I'm going to focus on the feature that really helped my schedule and how I operate. And that's the habits feature. And it's not just like your typical habit tracker. Okay. It's like having a super smart scheduling assistant that knows exactly when you should be doing what you need to be doing. Right. And I already know you like, yo, I tried habit tracking apps before and they never really stick. I know this because I did it. I tried a few of them myself and they didn't really work for me. And to be honest, it's because it was friction there. You know, most of these apps, they're like super rigid and they don't necessarily adapt to your changing schedule as it's changing. And, and if we've been real, when you work in certain spaces and industries, like sometimes no two days can be the same. And that's the case for me. So even in my outside life and just trying to have fun and dealing with family, it's still always changing. And that's where reclaim is different. Instead of forcing you to stick to a fixed schedule or totally jacking up your schedule, it's going to automatically find best time for your habits based on your actual calendar for that day. Let me tell you how I use it. First off, let's say I set a deep work habit for prospecting and client research for two hours a day between 9 a.m. and 2 p.m. What it's going to do is anytime in between those hours, it's going to fit that habit in there. Maybe I might have something like content creation, one to two hours, three times a week. Exercise, scheduled one hour between 6 a.m. and 8 a.m. Basically, anytime between that time block, I can get my hour in. And then maybe learning is a blocked hour for watching YouTube videos. It's going to fit that in somewhere. Here's where the magic comes in. Reclaim is going to automatically schedule all those things around all my meetings and everything else. And it can adjust when certain things change. So if I make an update in the middle of the day, like, you know, maybe my wife sent me a calendar invite for something that I maybe did, or maybe I didn't know about it. I can accept that knowing it's not going to mess up anything else in my schedule. And I don't have to like, look at my schedule manually. Right. And that's the fire part. So, you know, think of Reclaim like having a extremely organized friend that knows your schedule inside out. So if somebody asks you for a meeting during a planned gym time that was already set there, it's going to quickly find another perfect spot for that workout that falls between the times that you set. 
And so it's really like playing Tetris with your calendar, except AI is doing all the work, not you. And, and so, you know, all that brain power and all that can go to something else instead of your calendar. And so here's some like real world impact. And I can show you how it can change the daily routine, right? So before Reclaim, I'm like the person that's always saying like, you know what, I'll get to it when I get to it. Or, you know, anyway, if I'm being real, I'd never had time. I'm never getting to it. Uh, workout routine, inconsistent like super inconsistent. I'm not capping and saying that I'm there every day. I was inconsistent. Content creation, same thing. Cause I had a lot going on and you know, it, it up and down when it comes to uploading and having an upload schedule, really, uh, flexible. <laughs> I'll put it like that. Right. But since I've been using reclaim the habits feature, here's some things that can change. When it comes to getting work done, increased by 70%. When it comes to working out, not missing a day or workout in multiple weeks, that's a win for me. Content creation is a regular part of the schedule. And I actually have time for some lunch now, <laughs> right? Like, but why? It's because I scheduled it and it's in there because it does change. I don't necessarily always eat at the same times, you know, but if I say, hey, I can eat anywhere between 1 p.m. and 3. I ain't got to miss lunch no more, uh, right? And, and that's a win. Like, if you need to, you definitely need to schedule lunch. I know it's some of y'all out there like me, and you're not scheduling lunch, and that's bad. Get your lunch in, okay? Uh, but the best part, I, I promise you, it does happen automatically. So it, AI is going to find the perfect spot for everything based on my energy level and my calendar availability. So it's really like having that time traveling assistant that can see your future, right? And the perfect moment for each activity, but then it can also rearrange everything when life is throwing that curveball at you and you need to do something else. And, and trust me, y'all, I mean, the job that I do, curveballs come all the time. And so you definitely have to roll with those punches. Um, or if I want to stay with the baseball analogy, you got to hit that curveball, right? So some pro tips that I found while making Reclaim more powerful in my life. Um, the biggest challenge with any productivity tool is making it work for your specific needs. You know, everybody's schedule is different. So what works for one person might not necessarily work for another. So here's some top tips for maximizing Reclaim. Number one set realistic time windows when you're setting these habits up, right? So like, don't say that you work from 5 a.m. if you ain't a morning person, okay? Like if you need to push that back a couple hours, do it. Like, don't mess up your own like self, okay? Number two, use the buffer time feature between those habits. Like, you know you can't get from that lunch spot right after it is over. Put the 30 minute buffer time in there so you can get back to the crib or wherever, if you work from home, you know what I mean? So that you can get that done, right? They do add in buffers. Number three, mark your energy levels for different times of the day. Because remember y'all, if you put in the right energy level, it's going to put the right thing in that spot based on what you said, right? So, you know, if your energy level is not all the way there, once you finish lunch, and but you added a high energy thing there, it's not gonna work. AI knows that if you add it right. And so if you do that, it can really save you. Number four, connect it with your work calendar and it'll integrate seamlessly with that. And I'm telling you, it's gonna be good for you. Like I did the same thing. I have a lot of meetings that can just pop up randomly and you definitely need to be able to get those in. It's great when you can connect your work calendar to it. And then number five, start with like two or three habits and then build up from there. You might have a lot, but if you only have a few, like maybe adding exercise and reading, something like that, start there and then work up from there. And all these small tweaks are going to make a big difference in how effective Reclaim is going to work for you. So again, is Reclaim.ai worth trying? Yes. And here's why. It's going to adapt to your schedule automatically. It's going to help you maintain that work-life balance. It's going to help you make the habit building actually sustainable. So if you're trying to get more like consistent with your habits, it's going to help you do that. And it's going to help you save 
hours of manually scheduling every week. Like who wants to be up on a Sunday night trying to get this stuff done? Nobody, if you don't have to, right? So whether you're in a, a wild like role that always changes at work like me, or you're just a content creator trying to balance a busy life, it's going to be a game changer for you. And, and remember y'all, the habits feature is just one part of what reclaim.ai can do. It's so much more that you need to check out and try. And I want to hear from y'all, like what's some of your biggest scheduling challenges at the moment? Drop it in the comments below and I'll try and share how I wish reclaim to help that for you. Also, let me know if you'd like to see more videos on how I use other reclaim features to stay productive as well. So yeah, y'all let me know. Also subscribe for more tips. Hit the like button on this video if it did help you. Um, the link to try reclaim is in the description below. And yes, if you do sign up, it will help the channel to continue to grow. And I do thank you for that in advance. I'm Tech Bag Trey, and I'll see you in the next one.